Welcome back to my kitchen. Thank you for joining my channel again. And this is what we're doing. We're going to put chunks of frozen cantaloupe into this food processor and mulch it all up with some agave, some lemon juice, and water. I believe those are the only three things I put in. If it changes, I'll let you know when I come back. But right now we're going to cut up the cantaloupe, put it on a tray, and pop it in the freezer for about two hours. All right, pretty simple, really nice uh, dessert to have on a hot summer night, these hot summer nights that are coming up. And this is super, super easy. And instead of getting ice cream, which is laden with sugar and fat and all these things that you don't need, chop up a cantaloupe, a honeydew melon, probably strawberries. I do know that when you freeze this, any leftovers that you stick in a container. So when you pop it back in the freezer, it changes it to like an ice cube. So just throw that out there really quick so I don't forget. And yeah, let's start cutting up cantaloupe. And here's a little BTS for you. So I bought this rig to hold the iPhone so that I can mount it to my kitchen counter and <laughs> So because the counter is rounded, it needed a flat surface to get to. So if you can see that, I've got like a, a coaster there to get the grip a little better. Come up and it is a microphone mount. So you can see what I did. This is a, a tripod for the camera. There's the attachment and it is held together with the rubber band and the microphone stand and it kept going like this and falling so i stuck bug repellent bottle in there to hold it in place to get to oh and we're propped up by the coffee bag and since the coffee bag is holding this thing right here it was tilting just a little bit so the bananas are holding the coffee bag up <laughs> so, you know, I just have to laugh a little bit. And so you can see some of the little BTS that goes on with uh, creating a video that you just really have to laugh sometimes and be innovative and use what you've got until it works. And that's what's going on here. So when you see the shots of the countertop and the... Um, the cutting board and all that. <laughs> this is how it was done. <laughs> Here's all the chunks that we just cut up and spread them out on the sheet so that they have space between them. And this is a really yummy dessert. And there it all is on the baking sheet. And this is gonna, again, go into the freezer for about two hours. Okay, so welcome back. And we have the frozen cantaloupe chunks. We're gonna go ahead and put them in the uh, food processor. And you see, they just look like they did when they went in. Um, silicone mat should make it easy for them to come off. So I just plop them in. And then I'll be adding some lemon juice and agave and water. Um, I have added frozen pineapple before and it tastes really good. Um, that's about the extent of the experimenting I've done with this. Just the cantaloupe and some pineapple or without. Oh, wait a minute. I also did coconut cream one time. Um, but I just liked it with cantaloupe only. And it's storming here, so you might hear Bijou 
griping at the storm. I don't blame her. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna put this on, and what we'll do is start out with probably a quarter cup of agave. And I'll add more as it goes if it needs it. Go ahead and cut the lemon in half. And oops, get some of that in there. Just start it out. Nice, good squeeze. Whoa. It shot out somewhere. Not on the camera, that's good. Okay, and then start out with some water. I have a cup full here. I'm gonna give it just a, a quarter cup to start and then add it as we go. So this is how you do it. Lock that down and here we go. tell as it was going that it was going to need more liquid inside. You can see it just kind of all bunch up and get uh, get chunky in there but not really go anywhere. So I'm going to add a little bit more agave and we're already at half cup water. So I'll just keep going another quarter cup and see what that does. And it might take a whole cup. Oh we're getting there to the right consistency. Here I'll show you starts to look like. So you can see it's turning into that sorbet consistency. Um, so a little bit more water. And the cantaloupe already is sweet. Oh, I've just got a little bit of agave left, so why not just get it in there, be done. All right, so a little bit more liquid and a little bit more food processing time and I can kind of see in through the container that it's looking to be the consistency that I want. So let's uh, go ahead and pull some out and have a look. Like I said, I don't eat ice cream that often, so this to me is like one of those frozen treats that you can whip up really quick if you have a cantaloupe. <gasps> or, I know, it's okay, the thunder. Uh, here's the, oh dear. <laughs> There's the consistency of it, and uh, it's very sweet on its own. There's probably a quarter cup of agave in there, one full cup of water, and a half lemon, and it's just perfect. So that's what it is, cantaloupe sorbet. Thanks for joining me, and I will see you soon.